What is going on guys, it's about Adrian Racing and welcome back to another YouTube video. Now today guys, we have this, the Porsche 911 G3 RS and this is the final car in this series, series the Deutschland Design Series. So you guys remember, um, I'll put a link in the description below for all the other videos, but it all started with this car, the Mercedes-Benz Sprinter, and from there we actually, if I'm wrong, moved on to the Black Series, right here, and then the DTM Touring Car, the S4 Quattro, and lastly guys, today we've got this, the Porsche 911 G3 RS which is right here, in this amazing blue paint job and I want to give a huge shout out to Drifted D for the amazing hookup so actually, um, one of the things I like to do about Hot Wheels collection in general is to actually not buy a full set from one place but you know, go around Singapore hunting and find the individual pieces by myself so this was the last piece in the collection, I was actually I couldn't find this quite easily and at the end I actually saw Drifted D um, put up a listing for sale and I immediately dropped him a text and I got it from him. So huge shout out to him. I'll put a link to his channel in the description below as well. So do check him out. I mean, he's amazing and he's one of the reasons why I even started YouTube in the first place. Irregardless, today we have this, the Porsche 911 GT3 RS. I can keep saying it's an amazing name. I don't know why the GT3 RS. It's a very nice thing to say. And all in all, I'm going to quickly unbox this car. I'm going to show you a little bit of uh, um, design on the vehicle. And then uh, let me know in the comments below if you guys enjoyed this video. And if you guys did, um, do remember to subscribe, comment, like for more awesome content here on YouTube as well as TikTok. The link will also be in the description below. So without further ado, I actually unboxed it before. I'm um, just have a look around the car. So we're gonna quickly remove it. So you guys know that I keep the cards and actually put the cards up in the wall. So I'll show you that at the end towards as towards the end of the video as well. But for now, we're gonna focus entirely on this amazing, gorgeous vehicle. I mean, guys, we're gonna start right off with the color of this game, of this vehicle scheme, right? Just look at it, this amazing blue, it's not shiny, you know, it's not matte. I don't know what, I, I know there's an official name for this paint job, I'm not sure what it is. Irregardless, a huge fan of this blue paint job, I think it's amazing. I think Porsches in blue or silver, they look amazing. Uh, I've done a few reviews on different Porsches, mainlines and premiums. So uh, um, you can check them out on my channel. But yeah, we're going to start with the right side of the vehicle. Obviously, we've got the, the blacked out rims, which... These five spoke rims, they look amazing, honestly. Um, they're very simplistic, yet, you know, they just have this like racy, sporty vibe to them, which is really nice to see. And obviously, you can see the tail lights, but we'll get back to that when we talk about the rear of the vehicle. But for here, so we've got the wheels, and they spin amazingly well, which is nice, you know, it's nice to have a premium car with um, wheels that spin greatly well. Sometimes, sometimes with rubber tires, you know, it does pose as a problem. Obviously, we can see the Porsche decal right here as well with this black pinstripe that goes across the door handle and obviously we have the fuel pump door the fuel pump uh, entrance hole door whatever you want to call it right here the door handle the fuel pump handle yeah so right here we've got side mirrors we've got big mirrors you guys can see you can see the little decal over there the design element of the big mirror there so which is really nice it's a nice little touch to the car obviously the front wheels they've been amazing but they feel different from the rear wheel not really sure why but they spin amazingly well they look amazingly well as well you can have a look right there and then obviously we've got the side reflector lights right here and if you move on to the front we've got the iconic huge front lights headlights however it would have been nicer i think i always say this i say this all the time it would have been nicer if there were plastic temples but they aren't they're painted on top and it still looks nice it's a decent um you can see the porsche logo right here uh it's not really the best logo it just f fairly resembles the logo i assume we've got the front grille really amazing the turn uh signal lights as well you can see the front lip right there which is, it's a nice car i mean it looks amazing i'm super pumped to have this in my collection the wiper details is right there and if you look at the left side of the vehicle exactly same as the right the wheels once again it's been amazingly well we've got a porsche decal right there obviously the fuel pump is only on this side the door this the side doesn't have it the door handles right there the side mirrors or the wing mirrors if some people call it if you actually have a look at the inside you can see the steering wheel of the car as well as the center console and you know some of the other features you can see the gears gear lever right there i don't know if you can see it sorry about that anyways um now we're going to move on to the rear of the vehicle and here's where it gets nice because look at this guys this rear, I mean, Girls Nation, welcome back to the channel. And I realized, I have, I know this, guys. I know that recently I've been reviewing a lot of girthy vehicles and um, so much more to come because I really like a bag that looks looks amazing. 
and this is one of these bikes. I mean, look at it. The, G, the GT3 RS decal right there with the dual exhaust pipe right here. Obviously, we've got a real light temples, which I sh which I told you I will go through when we when we come to the back. Um, I don't know. If it's, uh, I, okay, I don't know about this, guys. I think it's a defect on the paint job, but you guys can have a look over here. You can see it's a bit grainy. I'm not really sure why that is or how that actually became that way. Um, let me know in the comments below if you guys you know have the same car and have experienced the same thing. I'm not really sure what's up with that. But yeah, obviously, we've got a real light temples right here. Once again, they're printed. They are not. Um, you know, plastic temples, which is which is okay. Um, I guess we can make do with that. And obviously, we've got the rear, um, skirts, or diffusers, whatever you want to call them as well. And the spoiler by itself, they look it looks amazing, right? I mean, look at the design and the intricacy of the, the spoiler. It looks really amazing. I'm a huge fan of this vehicle. And we're just gonna have a look from the top right here. Really nice. It's a very simple car. Um, obviously with a lot of horsepower, a lot of power, a lot of speed. In the GT3 RS models, they are known for their speed and their, I don't know, the viciousness in the road. <laughs> but all in all, I think this is an amazing vehicle. I'm super pumped to have this in my collection. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this vehicle. And with that, I've actually completed the entire series. So I'm super pumped to have this. This car means a lot to me because it's the first series that I've completed. And yeah, we're going to do a few rolling shots and I'll see you at the end. printer which is the first car and boss the 2.2 kv it's the video with the most views right there and then if you move on to the front right here we've got the dtm touring class right here and the black series right here and then obviously let's not forget the audi s4 quattro which is right here so here we've got this four cars and now the new car that's going to add, be added into the collection is this the porsche 911 gd3 rs it's going to go right here so obviously if you guys remember my i think it was a few videos ago i did the unboxing on that so that's the 911 gt3 if i'm not wrong obviously you can see the resemblance between them but obviously this has a lighter blue paint job so i hope you guys had an amazing time watching this video do remember to subscribe like and follow me for more awesome content but one last thing before let me just close that and it's right here so obviously um i told you guys right so here's where i put the the card so i'm gonna put the posh card right there and you know it's gonna complete the all five series right there obviously if you guys remember the like and hyper spot with the daily diecast signature right there so that's really nice but yeah don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more awesome content here on YouTube. The link will be in the description below. So do check it out. But just let it guess this video is over. And I'm out. Bye.